how do we navigate from one page to the other in Flutter? So one way of doing this is using the navigator class. So as you can see, I have this, we have this home page. Inside this home page, we have this elevated button here. So if you are to navigate to the second screen, what we have to do is to use the, the navigator class which will give us the push method so the push method takes in two it takes in two parameters as you can see it takes in it takes in the context and also the route so we are going to provide it the context and then the route is material page route the material page route which takes in the builder as a parameter and then the builder will take in the the context as an will take in an arrow function which takes in a context which will then return for us the second screen that we want to navigate to so as you can see the second screen that we want to navigate to so if we if we reload the application, if we reload, reload the application and then we go to application, and then if I click go to second page, you can see now it takes us to the second page. So let's go to the second screen widget. As you can see, now in this widget, we have two elevated buttons. We have the back to home page and then uh, go to third page. So how do we go back to our home page? So going back to our home page, what we do, we use also the navigator class. But instead of using the push method, we use the pop method. So the way this navigator class works is it works like the stack, the stack data structure, whereby whereby uh, screens are pushed or are stacked on top of each other. So, for example, when you start an application, it starts on the home page. That means that the home page is already in our stake. And then when we navigate to the, to, the, to the second screen, the second screen is pushed, is staked on top of the home screen. So if we are to go back to the, to the home page, what happens is if you know about stake data structures, is that it will be popped that means that it will be removed and then we will go back to the home page so let's reload the application and see what what goes what goes on as you can see if i click on the back to home page it popped the second screen it removed it and then we are left with the we are back to the home screen right so let's go back to our second screen and then how do we also go to the, our third screen? So to go to our third screen, we simply use the navigator class dot push. And then it takes in two parameters. We take in the context and we also take in the material page route as our class, which takes in the builder then the builder, the builder will take in the will take in the arrow function which takes in the context as our parameter and then this arrow function will return our third screen so if we reload our application, if we reload our application, if I click and go to third screen, as you can see, it takes us to our second screen. So now in our third screen, we also have two elevated buttons. We have back to second page and then back to home page. As I've said, if you want to go back to the second page that we are coming from, we simply use the navigator.pop which will take in the context as a parameter. And then if you want to go back to the home page, you have to use the navigator.push. And the, 
which we take in the context and material page routers parameters builder then we just simply use the home As you can see if I click on the home page then we are back to the home page so the second way of doing this is by using what you call routes so inside our material app class we provide what is called the initial route so this initial route is the route that's that's always on our application when our application starts so that's the initial route for our application and then we provide other routes inside we provide the home uh, the second screen and then the third screen but how do we then move how do we then navigate to the second class using this this type of using routes so here instead of using push we now use push named which will take in the context and then the route name our route name is second screen As you can see if uh, we reload our application if I say go to second page it will then go to our second page so let's simply copy this and use it in our second screen what do we do if we want to go back to the home page uh, here it doesn't change we will still use the pop but if we want to navigate to the third screen now what we have to simply do is we change this and then we replace it with the uh, with the route name which just say third screen if we reload our application As you can see it takes us to the third screen the same also we just need to change this navigator dot push and then use this and then we profile we change the route name to home so if we reload our application so if we reload our application now you can see that we are now going back to the home page so this is how you use how do we navigate from one screen to the other in flutter using the material page route and also using routes thanks for watching if you found this video useful please share and click on the notification bell so that you do not miss any of my videos